If you're an IT or a CAT student, then you're going to need some help with your theory. And I really encourage you to go get our flashcards, our flashcards that we use through Gizmo. So let's find out how you can access them. First of all, just to remind you, what is a flashcard? A flashcard is basically a way to help you study where you get, for example, like a question and you're going to try to answer the question. So in this case, what is a malicious program that replicates itself in order to spread to other computers over a network? Well, if you know the answer, then you'll know the answer is a computer worm. So it's a great way to ask yourself questions and then see what the answer is and, and test your knowledge to see if you're ready before that big test or exam. So in order to get our flashcards, what I would recommend that you do on your phone is that you go to either your Google Play Store or your Apple Store and you search for Gizmo AR. What you're looking for is that. It used to be called Save All, but now it's called Gizmo and you're looking for the option where it's got that little yellow star. That's the option that you're looking for. So once you've installed that app, noting that this is all for free, you can then go and sign in with your username and a password. If you don't have a username and password, that's fine. You can sign up. As I said, this resource is for free, so you don't need to pay anything. You can just make a free account. And then once you've signed in, right at the bottom there, you'll see all your options. I want you to look at the DEX option at the bottom corner and click on that. And then if you've already made DEX, your will, will be listed over here like mine. But I want you to go to that option at the top there called Public DEX. And when you go there, you'll get a list of all the decks that have been made public to everyone. Now, thankfully, Gizmo has made our decks public so that everyone can access it. All you need to do then is in that search bar, you're going to type in Mr. Long. And when you do that, you'll probably come to a page like this. And there you can see Mr. Long's flashcards are listed. So if you do CAT, you can use the CAT ones. If you do RT, you can use the RT ones. Now, all you have to do is click on one of them or both of them, whichever one you want to include. So let's say we're going to click on the CAT one and it'll look something like this. Now here's the key part, that little bookmark in the top corner there, I want you to click on that because when you do that, it means that that deck will be then saved to your decks so that every time you go into Gizmo and you go to decks, you don't have to search for Mr. Long's decks anymore, it'll be in your list of decks. So for example, let's take the IT ones. If you're going to use them, you can click on that quiz button and it'll ask you questions on all the content in the IT flashcard list. But if you want to maybe go onto particular grade 12 content, then you can just click on grade 12 and then click on the quiz button to be able to quiz yourself on all your grade 12 work. But if you want to go onto a particular section of grade 12, then you can just go into that particular subject. And so it's really easy for you to customize how you want to study. When you do a quiz, it's going to ask you random questions. Sometimes it'll give you options. Sometimes you'll have to type in the answer. In this case, what is the process of integrating different technologies into a single platform or device? For those of you who know your answers, that is obviously convergence. And then it gives you some points for, for getting the right answers. And so if you've saved the deck, all you need to do is go back to your own decks and you'll see that Mr. Long is now listed there with all your others. So I really want to encourage you to go get Mr. Long's Gizmo flashcards, whether you do RT or CAT. Ideally, you want to make use of the app, but you don't have to. If you go on your phone, just through your normal browser, you'll be able to go to Gizmo and be able to access everything that I just showed you. And if you don't have a smartphone, but you have a personal computer at home with internet access, then you can also go to gizmo.ar and you can get all of those features via your browser. If you are struggling to get those flashcards, then I've created a shortcut, for example, to the cat one. It's tinyurl.com slash cat flashcards. That will give you access to those. As long as you've already created an account on Gizmo, it'll work and if you want the RT flashcards it's tinyurl.com slash Mr. Long RT flashcards a reminder you must have created an account with Gizmo already before you enter in these links in a browser and so there you've got it you've got all the flashcards for RT and CAT we're going to keep adding more throughout the year so please make sure that you get Gizmo make sure that you go and save those deck of cards and I'm really positive that it's going to help you with your studying this year for CAT and RT theory Please click on that subscribe button, but also go to our other YouTube channel at Mr. Long Computer Terms if you want revision on your IT and CAT theory. There you'll find videos to help you there. Join us on TikTok at Mr. Long Education. And remember, don't do it the long way, do it the Mr. Long way.